Hey, hello everyone and welcome you all on the learn new and grow the world best learning platform as you already know that here you get the latest tech updates so today update is do you listen brave.com do you search it about brave.com do you know about brave.com so today topic is brave.com so what is this so i am going to tell you that with help from google impersonated brave.com website pushes malware so you should know about this because it can affect your mobile it can affect your device it can affect your life it can affect your everything so without losing without skipping this video you have to wait and listen and watch and learn many things okay in this video i am going to tell you that what is this brave.com and how this is spreading the malware and how users come in this trap and you also can be that come in its trap okay so for saving you have to come here and next one is what this fake site do to attract people this thing also i'm going to tell you but you you will have to wait and you will have to be my friend means you will have to come in my friend list for coming in my friend list you can subscribe okay you can encourage me to make this kind of videos the next one is wires working in different faces what are the faces you have to listen you have to be ready okay and the next one is what are the attackers different method to enter to enter you know device in your mobile in your pc in your laptop in your different kind of device you have to know about this also okay so as you also that you know here this kind of detail so let's start but before going to start i can suggest you that you can subscribe this channel share this channel with your friends so that your friend also could be up to date and like this channel so let's start scammers have been caught using a clever slight of hand to impersonate the website for a brave browser and using it in google ads to push malware that takes control of browsers and steals sensitive data how users come in its trap let's listen the attack worked by registering the domain x n b r a b y v a .com okay you can visit on my website also to know more and different interesting things to know okay you can visit link in description box and an encoded string that uses what's known as punny code to represent brave.com a name that when displayed in a browser address bars in confusingly similar to brave.com where people download the brave browser dot brave.com note the accent over the letter e was almost a perfect replica of brave.com with one crucial exception the download brave button grabbed a file that installed malware no known both as ours client and capture right it means different kind of websites if you i would like to tell you that if you click on the different attackers website which is same name with which same name okay you will find same name but that that website will be made by attackers when you click here the one one exception extension will can download inside you and that extension can be fulfilled with malware okay so you have to be aware with this also and what this fake site do to attract people to drive traffic to the fake site the scammers bought ads on google that were displayed when people searched for things involving browsers the ads looked big enough but when people clicked on one of the ads it directed them through several intermediary domains until they finally landed on brave.com jonathan sampson a web developer who works on brave said that the file available for download there was an iso image that was 303 mb in size 
inside one single executable okay so what are the wires working means wires working in different phases what are the phases of wires you have to listen this yeah, scammers have been caught using a clever sleight of hand to impersonate the website for the brave browser and using it in google ads to push malware that takes control of browsers and steals sensitive data the attack worked by registering the domain also the malware detected goes under several names including our client and set top rate a 2019 analysis analysis from security firm g data found that it was a remote access trojan it was capable of streaming a user's current desktop or creating a second invisible desktop that attackers could use to browse the internet. In a follow-on analysis published in February, GData said the malware had been updated to add new features and capabilities including encrypted communications with attackers controlled command control servers. A separate analysis found it had capabilities like connecting to C2 server, profiling the system, steel browser, history from browsers like Chrome and Firefox. Okay, the IP address that hosted the fake Brave site has been hosting other suspicious pin punny code domains including xnidgr xvaj.com xnsgnal m3a.com xn telegram ncb.com xn brave brav 8 vacom those translate into ledger.com signal.com telegram.com brave.com respectively so all of the domains were registered through name cheap okay yes so what are the attackers different method this thing we are going to understand that attackers behind this scam had been hosting other loca alike sites on other ips using a silent push product he searched for other punny code domains registered through namecheap and using the same web host he hit on seven additional sites that were also suspicious the results including the Pony code and translated domains are x and s c r e n c a s t e h b dot com screencast dot com okay fight simulator m d c dot com brave e v a dot com sockdust h z a dot com these kind of results are there in the last of conclusion I would like to tell you that Google removed the malicious ads once brave bro brought them to the company's attention namecheap took down the malicious domains after receiving a notification one of the thing that's so fiendish about these attacks is just how hard they are to detect because the attackers has complete control over the pony code domain the imposter site will have a valid tls certificate when the domain hosts an exact replica of the spoofed website even security aware people can be fooled sadly there are no clear ways to avoid these threats other than by taking a few extra seconds to spec the url as it appears in the address bar attacks using pony code based domains are nothing new this week's impersonation of brave.com suggests they are not going out of work you anytime soon so this was suggestion from me that you should aware to inspect the url don't click before reading before taking judgment about this url so yeah. how is this information if you like you can encourage me to make this kind of videos and i can i also say that i am encouraged by your subscribing this channel okay thank you for coming here